Alright, I see the deck. It's got to get painted. See the bike and everything's off. Well, I'm here going to start painting. Uh, I'm just getting the paint stuff all ready. I got this big deck. It's like 10 feet, 10, 12 feet by about the same, so she's square. The floor, all that's all I get painted. The steps, the railings, both sides, even the side there, everything, all painted. I just had to sweep off all the cobwebs, spider webs and stuff. And that's what I got now. My god, I didn't realize I can actually move that fast. <laughs> this paint was a really good paint. I was really surprised, especially with such a black or dark brown background to paint over top of. Um, this paint did very, very well. I decided to change the positioning of my camera multiple times just to give you guys a, a better view, a better angle of what I was doing and where I was at. And the fact that it was 29 above, almost 30, might have been around 30, give or take a few degrees. Either way, it was nice and sunny. Wasn't so windy. There wasn't a lot of bugs out. Um, I was surprised not to even see any hornets or uh, wasps because they always like to linger around, especially when you're painting. Maybe it's the color, it's not yellow. <laughs> I painted uh, machinery that was yellow, orange, and lime, and you always have wasps. Maybe it's the color, I don't know. Either way, it's good. And because it was uh, fairly warm out, the sun actually dried the paint relatively fast within a matter of minutes. Gives you the benefit of being able to see how the paint looks once it's dry. So that way, if there's any spots that are missed, you can paint over it again. That way when you're all done, it looks that much better. Which was really, really good. Yeah, the whole while my son was behaving very, very well, watching his iPad, thanks to my friend uh, having access to his, his Wi-Fi, so my son can watch his uh, cartoons on the iPad while I paint, because you know how little boys are, they want to be there with their daddy, so... That's exactly what would happen there. My son wanted to be with me, so not a problem. He got he got a chance to be outdoors and be able to watch his iPad, <laughs> watch cartoons, and yeah.
Well, took me five hours to paint her and one jug. A lot of cracks and tight corners I had to get into. Every one of them I got. And I just barely had enough to get the floor and then touch up everywhere else. So it's all done. My little helper, our son, He's watching his iPad while I painted this whole deck, floor everything, and there was a lot of nitty gritties in it. It looks like a 12 by 12 area, and then the steps and everything, it's all done. So, yeah, not bad. Aiden wants to go. <laughs> so we're going to go and get something to eat. Well, we spent over five hours painting Chris's deck. It was a 12 by 12 deck and the steps and everything. So I took Aiden so well, it was really good. So we're in here at uh, South Common Dairy Queen. He got himself a stitch pop. It is hot, 30 above the days. A few moments later. Oh my. What is that? Is that a banana split? Ice cream sundae? Oh my goodness. Oh, is that so yummy? Oh my goodness. Masara. Delicio. Eh? Got strawberries. Pineapple. Chocolate. Wow, so yummy. Goodness. I'm mixing it with the whipped cream. Oh my goodness. Ma set up. And you got the bananas. Where's my spoon? Goodness. Well, that's it for this video. Thanks for watching. Until the next adventure of Real Life's Journey.